Jake Ludington here at HP Discover, and I'm here with Christian Verstraat and Ken Wan. And we're going to talk a little bit about cloud and what are some of the, the challenges that uh, customers face in, in the cloud space. I think a lot of challenges customers face in the cloud space is that they realize very, very quickly when they go into the cloud that the cloud is not one size fits all, which means that different workloads really ought to be in different places in the cloud. On top of that, they all very quickly realize that their business users are actually using cloud behind the back of IT. We call that shadow IT. And so, the issue of the CIO is really how do I pull the whole of that thing together? and how I put the whole of that thing together in a way that is transparent to the end user. Because you don't want the end user to have to figure out that this type of a cloud service he is taking from a public cloud with a specific URL, this other one comes out of a private cloud, oh by the way, and this other functionality is actually still located in traditional environments. You want to get rid of that. You want for him, at least, to, for that to be completely transparent. That he can go to one place and get basically the service that he's actually looking for. That sounds a little bit complicated though, so um, I think, can you kind of have an answer around how, how you actually create that one place? So with cloud service automation, we have a single portal where customers come in and they can order services regardless of whether based on uh, private cloud, on, uh, on from, from public cloud services, from managed cloud environments, all fed up through this single portal. And what we've done is that we've made this management very comprehensive. So we have, HP has an incredible depth of experience in managing IT in traditional environments, dealing things like security, performance management, asset management, and we're bringing all this expertise into the cloud world. So now you have this comprehensive management environment for your cloud, so you, can, you don't have to worry about security or asset management, resource management. We have all those tools built into the, into the cloud solution. And so, so where do we go from there? Uh, from, you know, you kind of got, got this one solution, but how did, how did the customer kind of uh, implement that? So what goes beyond, what's, what's important for our customers is they have a lot of choice. You know, one of, the, one of the top concerns of customers these days is getting locked into a vendor. Uh, and, and we, HP, gives them a lot of flexibility in order to be able to give them, that, uh, give them the uh, avoid vendor lock-in. So we have support for multiple hypervisors, we have support for multiple hardware platforms, incredible amount of integration with third-party products, as well as we have support for, for OpenStack, for, for uh, open source products. It gives customers uh, uh, the uh, workload portability. Correct, what's really important to realize is that, uh, we, we said earlier that, that it's not one size fits all, but where you put things may evolve over periods of time. So you want to have that capability to take a workload and very quickly and easily bring it out to a different type of cloud than what it was originally developed for. Having that capability, having that portability capability through the use of common infrastructure, common environments like OpenStack, really gives you the power of being able to manage your environment at the best of both the agility and responsiveness requirements that you have, as well as the cost elements that you're actually looking for. So being able to balance both of those in the best possible way. And that's really what we're trying to achieve by pulling all of this together. All right, so where can people find out more about this? Well, you can find out more about uh, cloud service automation at hp.com slash go slash CSA. You can read about our blogs at hp.com slash go slash cloud blog as well. All right, and if you want to follow me on Twitter, um, Christian VE, and my blog is hp.com slash cloud slash blog.